Forget everything you thought you knew about electric sedans, because the 2026 Polestar 5 just rewrote the rulebook. This isn't just another pretty EV. This is 884 horsepower of Swedish engineering wrapped in a body so sleek it makes supercars jealous, and I'm getting behind the wheel today to find out if it lives up to the hype. What you're looking at right here is Polestar's flagship, their ultimate statement piece, and honestly, it's absolutely stunning. The design team took their precept concept from 2020 and somehow made it even better for production. Those dual blade headlights cut through the air like a knife, and check this out, there's no rear window, none. Just like the Polestar 4, they've gone full digital with cameras doing all the work. Bold move or design disaster? We'll find out. Under that gorgeous aluminum body lies something Polestar calls their performance architecture, and it's completely bonded aluminum construction. Not welded, bonded. This gives them a rigidity that rivals actual supercars while keeping weight surprisingly reasonable for a 200-inch long sedan. At 5,600 pounds, it's no lightweight, but for an EV this size, that's actually impressive. The numbers are absolutely insane. In performance trim, we're talking 884 horsepower and 749 pound-feet of torque from dual motors, 0 to 60 in just 3.1 seconds. That's Tesla Model S Plaid territory, folks. Even the base dual motor puts out 748 horses and hits 60 in 3.8 seconds. These aren't just good EV numbers, these are supercar numbers. But here's what really sets this apart. That massive 106 kilowatt hour battery pack operates at 800 volts. What does that mean for you? Charging from 10 to 80% in just 22 minutes when you find a 350 kilowatt charger. That's faster than most people take to grab lunch. Range is expected to hit over 300 miles, putting it right in Tesla Model S and Lucid Air territory. The interior continues Polestar's minimalist Swedish approach, but cranks up the luxury. That massive 14.5-inch portrait touchscreen runs Android Automotive with Google built in, and the sound system options are incredible. You can get the standard 10-speaker setup or go wild with the 21-speaker Bowers & Wilkins system, pushing 1,680 watts. The cabin feels spacious too, thanks to that enormous panoramic glass roof that stretches over six feet long. Despite weighing nearly three tons, this thing moves like a much smaller car. The adaptive dampers on the performance model can read the road surface 1,000 times per second and adjust in just three milliseconds. On track, it's incredibly composed, with that long wheelbase providing stability you wouldn't believe. The lack of rear glass is polarizing, I'll give you that. The camera system works fine, but there's something psychological about not having that physical connection to what's behind you. Some people will love the extra rear headroom it creates. Others will hate the principle. It's definitely a conversation starter. At an estimated starting price around $100,000 for the dual motor and $120,000 for the performance, this isn't cheap. But when you consider you're getting Lucid Air Performance, Tesla Acceleration, and Porsche build quality all wrapped up in uniquely Swedish design, it starts to make sense. This is Polestar's shot at the big leagues, competing directly with the best luxury EVs money can buy. The 2026 Polestar 5 launches in late 2025 or early 2026, and honestly, I think this could be the EV that finally gives Tesla some real competition in the premium sedan space. With its combination of jaw-dropping performance, cutting-edge technology, and that unmistakable Scandinavian style, the Polestar 5 isn't just entering the luxury EV market, it's here to dominate it. What do you think? Is the Polestar 5 the Tesla Model S killer we've been waiting for? Let me know in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe for more first looks at the cars that are shaping our electric future.
Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button and subscribe for more content just like this. Leave a comment below with your thoughts or questions. I read every single one. And don't forget to click the bell icon to get notified about my next upload. See you in the next video.